Hi Aquarius, thank you for being here on the Aqua Love channel. It means a lot. Please continue to show up, okay? All right, so let's get into it. Thank you guys for blessing the Aquarius with a clear, concise message. All right, so Aquarius, you got four cards pulled here. You could be dealing with all of these situations or just one. Let's see what's going on. Homeless and in need. So that could be you. That could be someone you're dealing with. Um, someone is in need of therapy. So, so a lot of in need, okay? So you could be dealing with someone who is in need, okay? Or you're in need. Um, spoiled wife. So some of you, the pamper princess, a little spoiled wife. You get everything that you want. Or maybe you're dealing with someone who has a spoiled wife here. And then you've got, yeah, late night creep and sneaky link. All right, so we've got wife and sneaky link in need of therapy, homeless and in need. Um, this, is, this could also be that some of you don't have a relationship, a romantic relationship, and you want one, okay? Um, and somebody needs to talk to somebody about their issues, about how they're feeling, okay? Um, somebody has some real issues here and they really won't even go into them. They just kind of cope. Yeah. Cause you got this coming out. Having feelings for nothing and no one is a coping method. Heal your sacral chakra. So there may be somebody here who maybe, um, is promiscuous sexually, you know, um, this is how they heal all of those different emotions that go through them, all those different feelings. Somebody turns off their feelings and they do things that maybe um, it just doesn't land well to the situation here. Let's see what's going on. It doesn't land well to healing. It doesn't land well to uh, becoming a better person, being better. All right, so that wanted to show up. Um, Aquarius, someone is letting you know or the cards are letting you know you give too much. Maybe in relationships, maybe you're, you're coming off as desperate or in need, okay? Let's see. Um, yeah, somebody is in a place of they're not interested in healing. Okay, they're just in, in a place of coping right now. So that could be way, that could be by way of drinking, smoking, engaging in you know uh, reckless, risky behavior. Let's see what else is going on for Aquarius or the people around them. Let's see. Um. We've got this showing up. You should probably run away from me. So somebody knows that they're full of shit, that they're um, maybe a low life, okay? And what they have for you is just lust, hence this late night creeping, this sneaky link, this running around town, this keeping you or the relationship a secret here. Yeah, somebody knows that they're low life here because they, they're saying, I know you're a good catch, but do you know how many times I've messed up a good thing? So they know that they're just, you know, um, they're a con man, a fraud, a liar. Everything that they say is cap is a lie, you know? Um, this is a good manipulator, a master manipulator. They knew how to get your feelings involved. You know, some people say getting people's feelings involved, making people fall in love makes the sex better. So, you know, there are very predatory people out there like that. Yeah, as I say that, protect yourself, burn your candles, and wear your crystals because maybe there's somebody in here, a master manipulator, maybe even throwing magic your way. I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm bad for you, and you know. Um, I'm bad for you, and I know it. Hell, you even know it. So, Aquarius, you know that somebody is just not good for you, okay? Um, someone is saying, I want more than one person. What do I do? So somebody is at a place of maybe confusion. They're not sure, Okay. They're not sure of what to do, uh, how to operate. They want more than one person. They didn't know that this was, this was going to happen, that they were going to have feelings for you. Let's see. Uh, yeah, they didn't know they were going to have feelings for you. Your love disrupted my loveless life. All right. They have intimacy issues. Somebody can't allow you to be close to them, vulnerable, or they, they can't allow themselves to be vulnerable. Someone... I masturbate to the thought of you. So somebody masturbates to the thought of you, whatever. Or this is what you're doing. Again, master manipulator. Somebody is trying to pull your energy in by way of magic. Um, the cards want you to, they're asking you to ask yourself, Aquarius, can you envision your future third eye chakra? So 
can you see what the future holds for you? Are you a visionary? Are you in that place of being able to take your mind to the future, see where you will be, and then come back to the present and make those significant changes, shifts in your energy that you need to make? Uh, the cards are saying the anxiety comes because of your insecurities, your root chakra. So maybe you need to do some root chakra healing. Anxiety um, because of your insecurities, um, because you um, lack of confidence here, maybe lack of knowledge. You know, you're insecure because you don't know how to or you don't know what they're doing. Or you don't know what is happening. You don't know where it's going. Therefore, it causes insecurities. And then hence. It causes anxiety. You're not at rest. You're not at peace. You overthink for some of you. Um, let's see how somebody feels about you, Aquarius. This is just a deep dive into so many different uh, dynamics of what all the different Aquarius are going through right now. So, it, you know, bits and pieces could resonate for you or all of it could resonate for you. Let's see. Aquarius we've got I am happiest when I want when I'm with you I want to be single so somebody wants to be single I give you money that should be enough so somebody provides or they give you money and they feel like okay that should be enough you should you know be okay with that yeah this is just about the sex okay so maybe they give you money they're just there for the sex they feel like it's an equal exchange um, let's see somebody feels like you're their soulmate twin flame or this is how you feel or it's mutual all right let's see this yeah someone is missing you and they're saying look if you call or text i will answer so they're putting all the onus all of the the ball in your court aquarius if you call if you text they will answer let's see i would choose you so somebody does have more than one partner we saw that when someone said i, I want more than one person but somebody's with a gold digger somebody that's got their hooks in them okay uh, and I, yeah, I haven't, I have things I haven't told you. So somebody's holding back a lot of different secrets. Again, that manipulative behavior, that master manipulator is coming out. Somebody is absolutely manipulative. That's the only way that they can control. They control from a, a place of fear, anxiety. They fear that maybe you'll see who they really are and you'll run away from them as they already said you should probably run away from them. Um, let's see, what else do we have for the Aquarius? Yeah, somebody's they leave you out or leaving you out um texting okay so um maybe they leave you out uh they, they'll text you they don't really um invite you out uh they try to keep the relationship on the phone or in the text message yeah um something about business uh they leave you out of their business or they try to keep you out of their business feminine energy showing up maybe there's a karmic feminine who um, is very dominant. We saw that with Gold Digger. They try to keep you out of that business that they have with her or vice versa. This is what you're doing, Aquarius. Yeah, security. Maybe they don't feel like you're safe or with you there is security. Ooh. Uh, yeah, with you, they feel like you could be their side chick forever or their side dude forever. You know, it's secured, it's in the bag. Uh, let's see, what else is going on here? For the Aquarius bored so somebody was bored or you're bored someone was bored so they decided to go outside of their relationship versus fix their relationship uh, they brought another party in let's see yeah all right so somebody's a loud mouth again this magic is coming up yes um, somebody's gonna have a residential move okay which is if that's what you're looking for, then that's good. Illness and sick, sickness. Maybe somebody's trying to throw magic your way so that you get ill, you get sick. Um, some of you are going to have a residential move or you need to have this. Um, let's see uh, what we can get. we got a yes answer showing up for some of you. Somebody is a stoner, smokes way too much. Or they smoke just enough. I don't know. This also could sometimes come up when somebody is just lazy and not putting in a lot of work. Somebody could be unkind. You know, maybe unfair. They're just not nice. Could be you, could be the other person. Let's see what's really going on here in terms of relationship. Um, someone could be El Cheapo. And sometimes that card comes up again when somebody's not putting in enough. El Cheapo, stoner, somebody's just lazy, um, not showing up to the relationship, um, giving just enough to keep somebody 
um, coming back or keep them interested. So we've got next week. Something is happening next week for you, Aquarius. Let's see. All right, that card I want to flip out. Um, so either you or the other person could be saying, I can't and I don't take you serious. And you just shrug it off because you know what you're, what you're getting into. You know that you've been here before with this person. You know that they offer only you manipulative behavior. Okay, let's see. Let's see what's going on for my Aquarius. I stare at your picture for hours. I'm obsessed. Somebody is obsessed with you. Though they won't give you what you want or what you deserve, they are obsessed with you is what I was just getting. All right, so let's see. Um, yeah, they love how you dress. They think you're a fashionista. Um, you're very uh, attractive to other people, to them. Um, you're a people magnet. You're charismatic. You're outgoing. Some of you are just absolutely gorgeous. Let's see. Uh, yeah, somebody feels like your body is perfect. But they're saying, look, don't text me. Don't call me. So somebody's like, look, I don't have energy for... They shouldn't text me, don't call me, because maybe I'm with someone else. I am I have my heart, my mind set on something else. Somebody else is not on you. Um, I don't want you to blow up my spot. I don't want you to... Uh, I don't want her or him to see you calling. I do I can't talk to you. I'm around this other person. Someone is horrible with money or horrible with valuable things. So maybe somebody took you for granted. They're horrible with seeing the value in people because maybe they don't even see the value in themselves. Yeah, money is holding me back. So we got two money cards. So somebody could be saying, I just don't have enough money to do what you want, Aquarius, to give you the life that you want. Money is holding uh, someone back. All right, so let's see. Um, let's see. Let's close this out, Aquarius. It just seems as if you're dealing with a mixed energy. There could be someone that has someone else. They made this the, the, the main woman or they made you the main woman. They have a side woman or man. Um, someone is just not able to give you what you're asking for at this time. Uh, maybe they never intended to give you this. They never intended to have the feelings that they have for you. Yeah, having no boundaries is not the answer. Solar plexus sh uh, chakra. So some of you need to do some solar plexus, solar plexus chakra work. Um, you have to have boundaries and everything with everybody. You know, or you'll be taken advantage of. You'll be a doormat. Someone is saying, look, I enjoy your company. Um, and they're aware of the shit they've done. Please forgive me, okay? Yeah, this is an energy of that master manipulator. They purposely keep you confused, Aquarius, because they know in confusion, people won't make decisions. I can't make it up. I just looked at the deck and looked down. Master manipulator. I will turn the situation around on you. Yeah, so somebody knows what they're doing. They know how to operate in that energy, okay? Um, religious differences separate you guys. So this could be that um, maybe, of course, it could be religion and spirituality. It could just be morality. It could just be value. It could just be that maybe, shit, you just are a better person than this other person. Someone's saying, look, I'll get back to you when I can, okay? So somebody's putting you on the back burner. Um, but they'll never let you go, okay? Um, and someone's saying, I love you so much, it scares me. So you get a different energy showing up here. Uh, I don't think this person has told you that they love you. Transform your heart. Transform your life. Heart chakra. All right. So for the desires of a man's heart. Um, so you got to um, transform your heart. All right. So whatever your heart is desiring, whether it be good or bad, um, especially if it's bad or it's just not good for you or it's not good for everybody involved. Um, if you transform that energy, you can transform your, your complete um, life. And for some of you, this is more so transforming your heart and the desires of your heart maybe for a particular person a relationship or um, wanting something to come in and complete you if you transform that way of thinking that way of uh, desiring you can transform your whole life you need to do some heart chakra healing um also believe in you aquarius solar plexus um you're getting to a place of understanding that somebody just doesn't want a relationship they want the idea of having a relationship they really don't want um, commitment. Um, they don't want to be 
um, responsible for. Let's see if we can get some more energies here. Oh, whoa, Aquarius. If you can see how those popped out. So an intellectual and an idiot. Jeez. So somebody feels like they're dealing with um, an idiot. Okay. And they're the intellectual or vice versa. I don't think anybody would call themselves an idiot, but someone could feel like they're the intellectual and they're just dealing with somebody who just doesn't meet their intellectual capacity. And maybe that's why they are disinterested. Yeah, you've got somebody lovesick over you or you're lovesick over someone. They just can't get out of the bed over you, Aquarius. Yeah, someone feels like you're really smart, book smart. Um, they feel like talking to you is like, um, I heard a walking encyclopedia, almanac, I don't know. Um, yeah, it talks too much. Someone just talks too much. They like to hear themselves talk, blah, blah, blah. This could be somebody who's all talk and no action. Um, either you or the other person needs to heal. But we, we got that card earlier. Somebody is not interested in healing. Heal, 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 heal. Healing is the answer. Telepathy. It's like you and this person can converse uh, telepathically, okay? And Aquarius, either you or another person has some spoiled, rotten children, okay? And somebody gets around. They are the town whore, okay? Um, somebody's just flashy. And they attract a lot of energy. And they do this purposely. You may have even caught this person cheating or they caught you cheating. It says just apologize. You know, somebody just needs to apologize. All right. Let's get some, um, some advice in here. You know, advice for you to take. Now, this was, you know, just to pull out some of the messier energies um, with the oracle cards you can get some of that energy um you get you know the manipulative behavior you get how people really feel um so you're not wondering and that's what this reading was about this just came out you got a definite yes because you got the yes with the exclamation point you got two yeses the other yes came out i'm going to clarify that that yes for you wow yes big happy changes are on the horizon for you i think because some of you are finally getting it you understand that this person doesn't want a relationship. They want the idea of one. So you're kind of releasing, relinquishing, the believing in yourself, believing that you can have something worth having. Yeah, you're meditating on what you want. And it's bringing you a lot of answers or you need to do so. Advice for the Aquarius. Yeah, be assertive. What does that mean? Be confident in your speech, how you talk, what you want. Don't back down. Don't cower down. Don't walk away. Ask for help from others, all right? Because um, others will open up that door. Yeah, and you are choosing a new direction or you need to choose one, all right? So let's go ahead and clarify this yes answer for the Aquarius. Let's see what's going on for my Aquarius in terms of this yes answer. All right, what's this yes answer for Aquarius? What's this, what's this yes answer for the Aquarius? This is yes answer for the Aquarius. Wow, yes, nine of swords. Um, yes, somebody is in a place of anxiety, overthinking, you know, in a hurtful place or space, maybe about you or vice versa. This is you. Somebody is at a place of not being able to cope with. Yeah, maybe the queen of wands that you're done with them. Maybe that it's over. Somebody feels like this is the beginning of the end. Yes, it is the beginning of the end. And they're going to feel it. Especially be, when some of you, you got your anxiety about maybe starting something new, starting a new business, putting your money somewhere. It looks like you're going to expand. Somebody has some real solo plans when it came to you. They didn't include you. Yeah. They were leaving you out and they were um, keeping the relationship stuck and stagnant. And it could be over now. They could be, whomever this is, they're spying on you. They want to know what you're up to and what you're doing. You see, you, very beautiful, abundant, and it's causing them a lot of anxiety that maybe even bruised their ego. Something was said. Yeah, this person wants to know. They want to, wow, Aquarius, if this is business, start that business do the research it's like you're coming out of 
some of you are gonna get a large sum of money you're gonna come out of this high level of anxiety you're gonna come out of maybe not having enough always being in a place of lack and then getting out of lack and then getting back into lack and look you go from ace of pentacles to ten of pentacles by way of your own knowledge there could like all right so this is how i'm reading it there's a delay in a yes answer and we got a yes answer we got a yes answer twice okay so there's a delay in a yes answer but the answer is yes it's a delay in a yes answer to maybe this loan this large sum of money this windfall this money that comes into you that you that's going to bring you a lot of abundance and security because you're going to grow it you're going to cultivate it you're going to even you're going to put it into something great something that is tangible so this is good aquarius just keep that in mind for some of you for some of you somebody wants to know how you go making money how you're gonna get this money how you did this thing or somebody just is really keeping tabs on you i'm trying to figure out if you are going to get this money so aquarius this is what i have for you um, go over to the website book your own reading there ask a question or two by texting the your question to the number below you can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy ella coffee link uh what else can you do i don't know what else you can do my brain is fried aquarius oh yeah you can catch me live either on this channel or the um el Toro channel tuesday thursday and sunday night 9 30 p.m eastern standard time thank you aquarius many blessings to you take care